to your broken heart. When the heart continues to nurture pain from the past, it is commonly known as a broken heart. Ask yourself if a heart can be broken. Does that mean if you hold on to this pain, your heart will be broken forever? Just the thought of it is enough to make anyone sad, numb and depressed. It feels like hope has left the building. Dive deep into your heart and ask the question. Are you broken? What does it mean to be broken? For well, your physical heart is in one piece, beating every day, loyally keeping you alive. If you are alive, so why does this concept make you feel as if you are dead? As if all life force has been sucked out of you? It feels that way, as it is just a concept, a belief. I am not broken, says your heart. I am just wounded. And wounds can be healed, right? Ask the question. Nurturing a pain that is not resolved is what causes the feeling of a broken heart, for your heart is not broken. Your heart is pretty much alive, beating, loving, caring. You still love. Love is all that is, the most beautiful feeling ever experienced. Pains and sufferings can be healed, they just take time. It is a choice to continue nurturing them or to work on them, to let them heal or let them go. Most of the time you won't let go of anything, but you can choose to heal what is wounded. It is when the wounding is healed that the feeling of letting go happens. The freedom is in the feeling, the letting go is just a concept behind the feeling. In the end, you end up scarred but healed. The scars leave you with memories. Memories that something good happened at some point in time. Something loving, something caring, valuable. There is a Japanese concept called Kintsugi or Kintsukuroi. The art of repairing a broken piece of pottery by mending it with gold. You can mend your so-called broken heart with gold. Like that, your wounded heart has more value than before, because nothing can take away the experience you gained from what has happened. Your heart becomes fuller, more precious and more loving. When your intention is pure at the starting point, the ending does not make it wrong, it just makes it painful. Pain is curable, pain has solutions, pain heals. Your heart is always whole, so it can choose to love forever. Who it chooses to love, you respect. For love is love, love is for everyone. Love is what keeps us alive, and your heart is very much in tune. And remember to forgive yourself and others for nurturing pain and suffering of the heart. But this heart of yours nurtures no pain, only love, for love is what the heart is about. Restricting love is what causes you pain and freedom to love releases you from the concept of separation that exists in a broken heart, as all its parts are separated if broken. There is no separation in a wounded heart, but only opportunities to heal and to love higher and stronger. So let's heal together.